All right, so in this video, I'm going to explain uh, that there are two different types of uh, climbs that you can do for the geyser. There's a slow geyser, which is pretty typical. Almost everybody does that one. Um, that's where you're mashing the button as fast as you can to climb to the next ledge. Um, and there's a second one, which I, I'd call a fast geyser. Um, where you don't mash it as fast, um, there's a set rhythm that you have to um, get used to, and you can climb this thing. I probably, I want to say between a half second and one second faster than normal. Um, normally, by the time that I get to the top of this, I won't see the uh, uh, the geyser <clears throat> at the bottom chasing me anymore. Um, even whenever I climb up to the top. So, um, I'll give an example of a slow geyser really fast, um, and I'm going to time it. See, I was just trailing right behind me, and once I get here, it's right there. Um, so, about nine seconds to do uh, that geyser climb. Uh, I'm going to reset this. One second. Alright, and... Now I'm going to try and do a fast geyser. So, um, yeah, it's about a second faster. The way that I perform um, the fast geyser is you have to be a little bit slower than normal um, with your button presses. Um, so what I normally try and do is, do you hear the um, hi-hat in the music in the background? So it's just uh, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, um, <clears throat> over and over again. I try and match it with that at first, and then I slow it down just a little bit. Probably to about a third of, of what the hi-hat is going at. But um, that's the best way that I can explain how to how to pull that off correctly.